Hello, hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome again to my channel Zeno Vision. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can install this awesome Lamborghini build year 2023 on your Grand Theft Auto 5 game. So stay tuned. Before we get started, I would like to inform you this video is for educational and entertainment purposes only. If you find any value in this video, which you will, please smash that like button and hit that subscribe button so you can start following my channel. So let's get started. I'm going to show you in this tutorial how you can install this vehicle and you're going to learn right away also how to install an add-on vehicle and a replace vehicle. So you can use this also for the other uh, vehicles. So let's get started by hitting download. Okay, then we're going to go to the downloaded folder. By the way, I will leave the link of uh, the Lamborghini on my Discord. And my Discord link will be uh, in the description. Uh, hit link number one first and then hit link number two then. And then you can add it. Uh, feel free to stay at the uh, Discord server if you want. We have a support page if you need any help and giveaways. Okay, uh, it's not a requirement to stay. It's all just for you. Uh, and the reason why it's on my Discord is because uh, the provider doesn't like it too much links in descriptions. Uh, so here we extracted it with WinRAW and then we're going to open it up. And then you have add on and replace. So yeah, let's open up OpenIV. If you don't know how to install OpenIV, check my video. I will leave the link in the in the card somewhere on the video. So it's going to be easy. Uh, let's open up OpenIV. Okay, browse this is the first time I just reinstalled OpenIV because I made a small tutorial on it. So let's open it up. Okay, OpenIV is opened up as you can see. Uh, let's just put this right here. Add on. Let's start with that. Let's go to mods, update, x64, DLC packs. And we're going to add it right here. Oh, we need to press edit mode first. Add it right here, and we're gonna go back to the Grand Theft Auto main directory folder in OpenIV. And we're gonna go to update, up, uh, mods update, update common data, and then we're gonna find the DLC list. Hit edit. We're gonna go all the way down, and we're gonna copy the last link. Your link will be 100% different, uh, unless it's a real coincidence we're going to copy this name exactly like how it is select this right here hit save so now we've installed the add-on then we're going to do the replace so uh yeah i have an easy mod folder that's right here mods update x64 dlc packs emf dlc x64 vehicles i can drag and drop this right here. So the Infernus in the game will be replaced by this Lamborghini. So you will see them driving around. Uh, in this case, if you don't have an easy mod folder, let's go over to the readme file and it will say, uh, where is it says? Is it? It does not say. It is only for add-on. Okay, uh, that's that's okay. We're just gonna go to uh, uh, mods, update x64 DLC packs. Um, let's see where can we add it. You can just uh, oh yeah, this is also something that I have. Let me just go back. Uh, let's go to update in your Grand Theft Auto main directory folder x64 DLC packs, and let's go to the latest one. That's gonna be this one right here and then x64 levels patch day vehicle mods no it's not going to be there let me check again so uh yeah patch 28 like i said dlc x64 levels gta vehicle so here we go back all the way update x64 uh dlc all the way down dlc X64 levels, Grand Theft Auto 5 vehicles. Here you see the newly add, added vehicles. Here we can just uh, select this and replace it. Then it will replace it also. Uh, I already have it in the mods folder. Uh, you can copy the mods folder so you'll separate your mods with, uh, with the original files. Doesn't really matter to me, but that's up to you. I highly recommend you downloading the 
easy mod folder i have a tutorial uh, about it in my channel so uh, let's start up uh, grand theft auto and see uh, if both vehicles are there uh, let's close this up and close this up and start up grand theft auto okay we're in the game let's go outside uh you also need simple trainer for this uh, to uh use add-on vehicles simple trainer or minio trainer let's go to vehicle spawning let's go to added vehicle menu and where is it was it this one i think it was oh this one right here so yeah It is working. Oh. That is awesome. Let's see if the inside is also working. It is. Dashboard is working and all. So that's about it for this video, folks. Also, you will see it replaced in the game with the Inferno vehicle. So, uh, don't worry about that. Yeah, thank you all for watching and... Uh, Goodbye, don't forget to smash that like button and hit that subscribe button.